My road to recovery began in 2014. I was deep into my heroin addiction, using and selling when my husband died in front of me and I was arrested. Recovery was never part of what I saw in my future. I didn't deserve it. I didn't want it. I fought it. I fought hard every day to keep my misery alive. After a lifetime of drugs, violence, incarceration, and loss, I went into a treatment program. If I hadn't had the support of my family and the drug court staff, I don't know if I would be where I am today. It took losing almost everything that I care about to realize something had to change. It wasn't easy, but it was worth every moment. I'm excited for my future, that I have a future, and a clean slate. All of these stories, I think, share several common aspects, but the most important one is their bravery. That many of them started using when they were as young as five years old. This is all they have known. And they've struggled throughout all of their childhood, all of their adolescence, and all of their adulthood to find a life, to find some happiness, to find some recovery. And the common link is not only that part, the, the suffering part, but the most common link is that they never gave up. No matter how many times they fell down, they always got up. To me, that's heroism. To keep fighting that battle, that's the most important common thread. And we have to recognize that. <laughs>